Oh, is my dashboard frozen again? Twitch. Okay, I think we are <laughs> ready to go. Nah, I've already said my goodbyes. I must have come back here for a reason, right? I don't collect art, and I also don't collect whatever that is. Yeah, we know you're a bit snarky, we get it. Which way did we go that was blocked? I wasn't paying attention, to be honest. Is it going to be both ways of the block? Deep the ambush is the other way. Okay, so it wants me to do something here. We just don't know what. Thank you for the follow, Winterfang Neo. You hear that? He's back at the gas tower. He's got a lot of nerve, that piece of trash. Let's get him. All units, follow me. Well, that seems a bit stupid. Scarper. I oh, like they wouldn't see him. Come on. Come on. Oh, the gang's all here. Ben, how'd you get behind us? Where are the suits? Corley's making a pit stop. He has a bladder the size of a thimble, man. Ripburger? Haven't seen him in a while. Ben, man, what's the deal? Did you find something up the road? Are we headed for trouble? No. We're in it. <laughs> Put my head in a basket, cause I'd had a tank full. When she blow my gasket, I surely <laughs> was thankful. Till I head for the skies up above. It's a woman with wheels that I love. Yeah. Come on, old man. I gotcha. Now, do something incriminating. Like ambush somebody. Aha, the plot thickens. Uh oh. You shouldn't have laughed at me in those board meetings, Malcolm. What a psycho. Gotcha. <laughs> hey, look what I found in the bushes. What is that? It's a chokehold. Come here and I'll demonstrate. It's got a camera. It's nice. Get her. No. Nestor will take care of her. You have an important engagement with the rest of the Corley family. Right. But don't forget to destroy that camera. Yeah, yeah. I bet he does. Now then, Malcolm. How about one for the road? Corley? Corley? Ben! Oh, he's still alive. <sighs> I guess Rip Burger couldn't wait for natural causes. Just like him to hit a man when his flies down. <laughs> 
Rip Burger did this to you? Yeah, he knew I was dying, and he knew that my will would put him out of a job. He wants to take over Corley Motors, Ben. Sell it off to foreigners, lay off workers, start making minivans. Oh, everyone likes a nice minivan. Minivans! Oh. <coughs> you gotta hurt him for me, Ben. Promise me you'll hurt him bad. <laughs> I promise. <laughs> I want my daughter to take over the company. You have a daughter? Yeah, and she's a real mechanical genius, Ben. Rebuilt her first carburetor when she was four. Eh, I used to call her the diaper dynamo. <coughs> Find my daughter, Ben. Find Maureen. Maureen? Dun dun Maureen. dun. <laughs> Good old toasters. Rip Burger's way ahead of me. I just hope Maureen can handle herself until I get there. Mm, Gun, I understand. Why'd he bring a camera? <laughs> Who does this guy work for? Corley Motors. Nestor. What's that moving over there by that pile? I don't know, Rip, but I think that pile is Boris. <laughs> <sighs> yes, now I remember. You're the smart one, aren't you? There's Moe's shack, but I don't see the limo. Maybe I beat the limo. I don't think so. Time. Maybe I didn't. <laughs> Looks like someone searched this place in a hurry. Nothing left but debris, except for that smashed up camera. Back's open. No film inside. Hmm. Mo said she didn't have a camera. Here's Mo's picture of her and her Uncle Pete at his mink ranch. She said she went there whenever she needed to get away for a while. That's pretty much my only lead right now. I take it there's nothing I can Looks pick like up. someone searched this place in a hurry. Nothing left but debris. Oh, except yeah, for that get smashed it. Up Oh, that didn't Camera. work. <laughs> okay, so do we have to try and find this mink farm? Who knows? Well, I know that we do, but... It's empty. We need to do that straight away. <laughs> what the hell is going on there? Oh, that's probably where the dead man is. So much for returning to the scene of the crime. They'll be coming this way soon. I gotta get a plan. Fast. Okay. I oh, don't go and park there. I'm just going to try and go the other way. Let's see what's over yonder. Look at this uh, truck. This sucker's mine. What? Look, I really need a ride. Look, I really need a ride. Okay. Hey, killer. What? Uh. Hey, it's cool. Your secret's safe with me. What secret? Haven't you been watching the news? Once again, our top story tonight, Malcolm Corley, owner of Corley Motors, was found dead at a rest stop just outside the town of Melonweed. Apparently, the benevolent patriarch and CEO I'm assuming we're being blamed was for this. viciously beaten about the head and neck. 
savagely and without mercy. Police have arrested a notorious outlaw biker gang known as the Polecats. No. With the exception of their leader, who is still at large. Roadblocks have been set up along Highway 9 in an effort to apprehend this dangerous and violent criminal. We've been set up. Roadblocks suck. I shouldn't have left the gang there. Hey, I don't want to hear anything about it. You ain't making me an accessory after the fact. Just lay low, man. Bear with me a second, everybody. Okay, so I'm assuming this is the truck driver. And that's our plan to get through the roadblock, I'm assuming. No, go away, infantry. There we go. Look, let me tell you what happened. I told you, I don't want to get involved. Okay, let's talk to... How do we know his name? I can do that. Not gonna happen. Seem to have a lot of time on your hands. Not to mention nicks and scratches. <laughs> <laughs> Am I distracting you? <laughs> That's your truck out front. I need a ride. I look like a cabbie to you. Get lost. They're not letting anyone through that roadblock anyway. Not even truckers? They turned me around and said police business only. Pigs. Look, I really need a ride. Not gonna happen. Why? Because <laughs> you're afraid of some cops? Oh. No, because I don't like you. I don't think that's good for the table. <laughs> hey, Quahog. <laughs> yeah, Emmett? I'm gonna be knifing up your table for a while, all right? The customer with the knife is always right. <laughs> nice. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. I just killed a guy. I'm just about to. <laughs> Let me show you how to do that. Not gonna happen. Good talking to you. Friendly folks you get in here. Damn, it's not what you'd call an I'm okay, you're okay person. Ah, shut your hole, Quahog. I need to get to this place. Uncle Pete's mink ranch. I need to go in that direction too, but the pigs are running the sty tonight. How poetic. Okay, we're both going in the same direction. Um, go away, infantry. Go. He's got a knife. So what, you coward? He's got a knife. Yeah, right. Play. <laughs> Play. Hmm. Look, let me tell you what happened. I told you I don't want to get involved. This is going to be the reporter lady. Over here! I'll take ben, that as a yes. No time to talk. You know, it's stank in there, but I can't remember a better sleep. You gotta help me. <laughs> Go find my editor in Corville. Tell him I took pictures of the Corley murder. You got pictures? Yeah, but some thug took my camera. So you don't have any pictures? Well, I tracked the guy to Melonweed. But I'm not going near the place. They'd kill me. Get my editor. He's got to get me out of this. Take one of these fake IDs to get through the roadblocks. Ooh. <laughs> my crew 
career is riding on those pictures. Help me, Ben. You're my only hope. Oh, oh, don't worry. Yeah. I owe you one. <laughs> if Miranda's thug is the same one that trashed Moe's place, that could be Miranda's camera I saw there. But then, who's got the film? I'm gonna guess Rip Burger. Do I still want the truck man or not? I'm confused. Here. What's that? Fake federal investigator ID. Could be of some use at one of those roadblocks. Hmm. So how about a ride? What if they search the back and find my bike? It's buried in a pile of concentrated fertilizer powder. <laughs> Trust me, no one's gonna dig through that crap. Now you're gonna ride in the engine compartment. The engine compartment? Hey! I smuggle stuff in there all the time, and most of it's worth more than you. So stuff your carcass in there quick, and we might hit that mink dump by morning. Hope you're better with a stick shift than you are with a knife. Yeah, yeah. Huh. Oh, great. Smells like he's got a fuel leak. I love engine fires. Hope he doesn't turn us Sorry, in. Sorry, sir. Only police vehicles beyond this point. I'm with the feds, Jump. Check it out. Huh? What's this about? Undercover agricultural sting operation. <laughs> What's in the back? <laughs> Fertilizer. All right, move along. Hope you rubes get your man. <laughs> <laughs> Hose and nothing big. Uh, I, I already pulled your bike out. It's sitting right over there. Well, nice knowing you. Gotta hit the road, you know. Anyone else is a little bit suspicious of this man? Uh oh. He did have a fuel leak, and he took my fuel line to fix it. Ah. That trucker's gonna die for what he did. I don't have anything. I don't even have a picture of the lock. I don't have anything. I couldn't break that lock. Oh, good. That's the insignia of the vultures. I can't believe Mo used to be a vulture. But then again, how else could she have gotten that recoil booster? Hmm. No. She and the vultures are some kind of rival bike gang. There's a picture of Maureen and Malcolm. Looks like they're restoring an old hardtail together. No mementos. I'll have scars enough to remind me of this trip. Looks like a mink pelt. Makes sense. I'm not into furs. I don't walk. The barn's locked. The barn's locked. Open up, you minx. Huh. Um. Where else can I go? That trucker's gonna die for what he did. That's going to be off. Miss something in here? I don't have anything. Have a pelt. Lots of bikes. Lots of bikes. 
Okay, I think it's just picture and pictures. This must be the window Maureen stared out of as a young girl, dreaming of her life repairing toasters. <laughs> Rustic. Now I have a tie, Ryan. Not after Mo made it so nice. <laughs> Hard of gold. All right, I'm gonna try and break into this with fire. Right. It's meant for nuts. Okay, that didn't work. Are you wanting to take anything off your bike? It's meant for nuts. Ah, oh, so. uh, junk. And a hose I can use on my bike. I don't think Mo would mind if I borrow him. Mo? I think someone's stealing your bike. Oh no. Oh, not more of these fight scenes. Oh no, that's that's Mo we're chasing. Whoa! <laughs> Have we got one of those? She took my booster fuel. Uh, why is she running from me? She must think the whole world's against her. I think I know how that feels. A oh, bloody trucker. That does it. He's dead. <laughs> that sign. That means I'm in cave fish territory. I'm assuming that's not good. At least they don't look like the sand people. <laughs> wow, that is not subtle. <laughs> oh, and there goes the bridge. looks deserted maybe the boss was wrong and she ain't coming here <laughs> she's coming we just got here first that means all we have to do is sit here and wait well, that's good for us what a stinking mess Maybe I'll just take a little. <laughs> Looks like Emmett dropped a load here. Nice. It's bolted on. Well, that's all of them. Can't be much holding that up now. I ain't looking to buy. Where are you going?
Why did we do that? What a mess. I'd call that a road hazard. Assuming that's what we wanted? Oh, I have no idea. Unless we couldn't get through before because of the stuff, but just ride through it. Oh, apparently you can only ride that way. Oh no, there's the sign. Oh. Maybe that was it, maybe I solved the puzzle I didn't even know we had to solve. Oh god. What's all this about? Just now to some kind of stupid random maze puzzle? Tell his father talk. I haven't seen you since you retired from the Polecats. Hey, Ben. How's my gang doing? Uh, that's a long story. What are you doing out here? Well, retirement's pretty boring, Ben. <laughs> so I thought I'd come out to the old mine road and look for trouble. You're picking fights? That's what the old mine road's for, son. Father Tork, I need your help. The gang's in jail and the law... Ben, I'm not the leader of the Polecats anymore. You are. Can't you see I'm on permanent vacation? You know any way around Cuyahoga Gorge? Around it? <laughs> it's miles and miles long, Ben. What's the matter? Don't like bridges? It blew up. <laughs> Ooh, sorry I missed that. Well, you could jump it, like Ricky Myron. Cape Fish got his ramp in their hideout, you know. Okay. Where is the Cape Fish hideout exactly? Somewhere on this road. The entrance is totally invisible unless you got those weird Cape Fish specs. Okay, so we've got to beat a Cave Fish. Any fighting tips, Tork? Ah, oh, Ben, who's tougher than you? What's up with those cave fish, man? Watch out, Ben. They're not out here for sport. They hijack big rigs. It's part of their religion. Don't get in their way. They're blind, cold-hearted killers. You're right. No one's tougher than me. That's my boy. Well, take it easy, father. Give him hell, Polecat. I'm assuming this is going to be a fight. Say there, is that a pre-regulation destroyer class solid fuel recoil booster you have there? Why, yes it is. <laughs> Ta-da! <coughs> okay. <laughs> weird. Like huh? <clears throat> okay, they had a chainsaw. <laughs> I got the tire iron, I suppose. Can I use that? I don't know. Apparently I fell off my bike.
And I'm back here. <laughs> oh, this is going to be one of these. Tedious, make the game longer bits, isn't it? Surely I can beat this guy. Hey, it's my old friend what's your name? Glad to see you all rehabilitated. My knuckles are starting to hit. Okay, I couldn't actually do anything for that entire process. That was fun. Well, I got him. <laughs> I now have a chain. Okay, so it's a rock, paper, scissor type game, is it? It's not getting tedious at all. Okay, I think I'm going to crash again. Oh, there we go. Oh, Kfish. He's just going to have to boost it, right? Suck nitro, snail bait! That should have a couple of good boosts left in it. <laughs> oh, I got him off his bike. A boost, I'm assuming, is for the jump. Okay, now I have a chainsaw. <laughs> so it's chainsaw for the cave fish. I fell off my bike again, apparently. old father talk father talk hey man we've been through this well, take it easy father i don't want to do Give it again hell, poke at. oh kfish 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 This should give me the goggles, right? Or not? Well, that's annoying. Hey, 
bad. <laughs> okay. We're well, getting a nice arsenal going now. Ah, the trick is you shouldn't actually try and turn the corner. It does it for you. And now you know. Well, I think it's only really cave fish I'm looking for now. I know I can knock them off, but how do I stop them? Ah, uh... oh, stop it now. This is like insult sword fighting, but so much worse. I am back. Okay, I've now got a plank of wood. Okay, cave fish. I think it's definitely the chainsaw, but how do I stop them exploding themselves and their bike up? Ah, oh, okay. Apparently, I'm not allowed to take that exit. Ah, oh, bloody hell. Father Tor. Hey, Ben. Any fighting tips, Tork? Ah, oh, Ben, who's tough? I'm assuming than they you? give me him because I'm not doing it right. How do the cave fish ride if they're blind? Well, they're only blind because they wear those special goggles to shield their sensitive cave-dwelling eyes. Special sensors in the goggles pick up the dots in the road and other large objects and landmarks to help them navigate. <laughs> kind of trippy, huh? You're right. No one's tougher than uh, bro, uh, That's I... my boy. Well, take it easy, father. Do I have Give to lead them into okay. a trap? But how would I even get them into a trap? I think I've got to get them to chase me. Maybe I just have to attack more of them? It's not like I can stop while I'm riding here and do something with the dots. I don't think I can set anything up there. Same old nonsense. The only other thing I can try is the plank of wood, I suppose. Ah, oh, but I must say, I find this incredibly tedious. Oh, 
Bum, ba -dum, bum, bum. Okay, keyfish. Plank of wood works as well. Oh, and obviously send them. Oh, trippy. I'm assuming I now just ride around until I find the secret cave entrance. It was clicking for the exit. Should I have taken it? Everything is so much slower. I think I may have done the wrong thing there. Well, I found the bridge. <laughs> oh, what the hell's going on? Let's put these goggles on. Beeping is getting louder and quicker. Did I miss it? I didn't see anything. I've just made the same mistake again, haven't I? Oh no, truck's outside. Yeah, I could just drive for it. Why did I do that in the first place? Alright, fair time's the charm. Come on. Where are you, Hidden Cave? No, I have to stop doing that. <laughs> oh, we're back at the bridge. Apparently I didn't want to take that exit. Alright, stop clicking when it starts to beep. Did we just drive straight past it? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Beeping like I should turn off. But that doesn't seem to have helped. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. All the fun of riding round in circles. now just riding around in circles. I think. Uh, 
Does that beeping have nothing to do with trying to find this cave? That seemed to beep a bit more. Let's just keep on going. Oh, now it's really beeping. Did I just miss it? Or does that just beep? Because there's an exit coming up. It needs to beep for every exit. But I'm now pretty sure I've been around this entire road network. Yeah, it just seems to beep when there's a turn off. But one does seem to beep more than the others, so when we go past that one, I'll turn off, I guess. I don't know if that little square thing down the bottom is meant to be telling me anything. I haven't been looking at it. You should not have to fight anyone with these goggles on, but... Okay, it's around here, I think. These things change colour? I haven't been looking at the things on the road. I think that was the one I wanted to turn off at. Ah, shit. They just take us to the highways, right? Yeah. Right, I don't know what you meant to do there. And I don't think I've got enough time to work it out this video, unfortunately. So maybe I'll wait till we hit the bridge and then I'm going to call it a day, I think. Thanks for watching, if there's anyone out there. I will be back tomorrow. Oh no, I won't tomorrow, Saturday. Probably back Monday.